have you watched Bridgerton? Oh my God, did you see what the prince did? Oh, oh, have you watched um, uh, uh, Green, Green, Green Leaf? Oh my God, did you see what Grace did? Oh wow, there's this new TV show. You've got to watch it. Oh my God, I'm going to the pub with my friends. You know, this weekend my girlfriends and I are going clubbing. Yeah, there's this new club that has opened up in Douala. Oh my God, you know, I'm going to have fun. Oh, goodness. I'm not here to spoil your fun, okay? Before you, you know, switch off my video, I'm not here to, to spoil your fun. But what I want to tell you is that we should learn to balance things off and to educate ourselves more than we entertain ourselves. Hey beautiful people, hope you all are doing very well today. Welcome back to the Young and Independent show where we discuss all things A plus mindset, personal development and financial freedom for young Africans by an African. My name is Sylvie. If this is your first time, welcome to the channel. And if you're returning, thank you so much for coming back. So today I want to talk about education over entertainment and I'll just read a few comments. So I made a comment on a Facebook post, um, oh, a Facebook group. Um, on um, uh, about this topic okay let me just read some of the reactions that I got some were very personal I felt like I was being attacked <laughs> I felt literally felt like I was being attacked by these um, by some of the people who responded to my to my uh, to my question and my question was why is it that most of the people who need education are gravitating towards entertainment that was my question so there's some people who are so broke in fact literally before my sister switched on the camera i said to her that do you know that there are people who have watched all the tv shows like they know the latest tv shows they've watched episodes upon episodes but they're on benefits like they ain't got any money in the bank I mean, you might be on benefits. No, I don't. I don't have any issues about that. But th this this is an African video anyway, uh, and no benefits in Africa. But there's some people who have their uh, their golden gooses. <laughs> they have their golden gooses that lay that lay their golden eggs, and they can afford to to just lazy around and not do much and watch all the TV shows and the Bridgertons. And all this, you know, be aware of every star's life. Like Tony Robbins once said that some of us are more aware of everything that is going on in the life of a celebrity than we are aware of the goals that we have for our own life. Ooh, I thought that was so deep and so true. And I wanted to say something. I wanted to say that it is very important for us to recalibrate. It's very important for us to set new priorities for our lives. It is very important for us to choose what is right at what point in time. The Bible says that there's time for everything, a time to laugh and a time to cry, a time to educate yourself and a time to entertain yourself. I ain't got no problem about education and I mean, about entertainment. Matter of fact, my sister and I watched a really nice uh, video yesterday. And before I did um, watch that video, I had done so much work during the day. I'm not here to brag. I'm just telling you that in order to make progress in your life, you have to learn what is right for you. And if it, uh, entertaining yourself is right for you, please, by all means, go ahead. But I don't know anyone who entertains themselves all day long and they grow. Some of us are just complaining about what other people are not doing for us. When those people are grinding their, that's the, they're, they're, they're burning the midnight candle, trying to make all this, put all to, 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 to build their puzzle and make progress in life, to learn all these new skills, to apply for all these new jobs. And some of us are just there, zapping through TV shows, upon TV shows, having a conversation in bars with our friends, hanging out with women and all those things. I mean, when I look at some of the uh, posts that gain traction in Africa, right? it is entertainment post it's just the truth it's i'm sorry i'm sorry that i'm a bit too blunt but it's the truth
once that gained traction that has all the hundreds of thousands of likes and views it's entertainment oh this one has happened to david oh this one didn't happen to kiss daniel this one didn't happen to all these names i'm sorry but i'm not going to sit here and pretend that i really know these people because i don't and you can clearly see from 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 my life that i'm making you know the choice that, and, and going towards the direction that i want my life to go towards if you want to make progress in your life quit minding other people's business because as much as you're watching these shows, you're getting these guys richer while you're becoming broker. Instead of complaining about what other people haven't done for you, start educating yourself. Because Jim Rohn said that we will be, re we will be uh, 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 remunerated exactly as per the value that we bring to the marketplace. Do you know what's the marketplace? The marketplace is the job market. It's the business world. That's what you get. What you plant is what you harvest. Spend as much time studying, spend as much, as much time learning new skills and get out as much and then go into the world and blow people's minds away. Get paid. Why do you think some people get paid 5,000 uh, francs uh, for an, an entire day? Other people get 5,000 francs for an hour. Why? The other person is more educated. I was having this conversation with a friend of mine in Cameroon and I said to him that, uh, I don't know what I said to him, I said people want to entertain themselves. He said to me, oh, you know, people work so hard in Africa, it's only normal that when they are done with work they should go to a bar and have drinks and, and all that. I said, well, if you continue entertaining yourself over when you're done, you so when you're done with your job, go and work on your own goals. When you're done giving eight hours to your employer, go home the other four hours before you go to bed. Work on your own thing. Educate yourself about a new skill. Educate yourself about how to sell on Fiverr. Educate yourself about how to sell on, on, uh, on, on freelancer.com, on upwork.com. Educate yourself on how to start a podcast. Educate yourself on how to start blogging. Educate yourself on how to grow a YouTube channel. Educate yourself. On how to have a better life. Man, I ain't falling from heaven anymore, people. It's not going to happen. Gone, done, and dusted. Jesus said that He has given us choice, freedom of choice. As much as you've got freedom to watch TV, to entertain yourself, go, go to parties and all that, never absent, you've also got freedom to do the right thing and to not go around overburdening people when you know you're you're just so damn lazy you wouldn't do anything to improve your life but you expect people to do stuff for you my friend Annie told me that a friend of hers a classmate called her and said oh um, I'm, I'm struggling can you please send me some dollars and she said oh I can send you a link to a, I can send you a link to a scholarship program in Sweden and you can apply and go to Sweden, you know, perhaps if Africa is too difficult for you, you can find your bread and butter in Sweden. And do you know what this guy said to her? I'm not ready to live that busy life that you guys live abroad. <laughs> so you're not willing to educate yourself to get this scholarship and to improve your life. If, if there's a problem where you are, if you're struggling financially and you need support from people who are abroad. So you're not, you're not willing to do that, but you want the money. You're not willing to do anything. You're not willing to educate yourself. You'd rather entertain yourself. But you want other people to pay for your lifestyle. It's not cutting it, people. These people out here, where I am, they're wising up. They're wising up. They're wising up. So we have to start thinking about educating ourselves. That's the way we're going to change our continent. That's the way we will change our continent. Did I lie? Where's the lie there? Like the Nigerian man will say in what I've said. If you think I've lied, please drop a comment in the comment section. If you think that entertainment is better than education. And when I talk about education, I'm not talking about classroom, okay? I'm talking about your own self-learning. What are you learning? My younger sister right now, she's learning how to trade. Trade stocks. She's just following someone on YouTube. She could have been on YouTube watching all sorts of bullshit, okay? But she's out there 
learning how to buy and sell currencies, not stocks, currencies. Tomorrow when she blows up, she pulls a trade and she blows up and she's riding her fancy Range Rover. Mm -hmm. Young girl in her 20s, she's got a house and a nice Range Rover. People start saying, oh, that one, she's sleeping around. Men did that for her. No, she's educating herself. She is. Attend seminars, listen to podcasts, watch things that educate you like this video. I'm sorry for screaming at you, but I've had enough of people complaining that life is terrible when they are not doing anything to change their life. So please educate yourselves. Share this video with anyone that you think that they need this, 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 this information. By the way, I think everyone should watch this. Everyone. Because sometimes we need to be, to be reminded and smacked on the head and just scream that to say, listen, get your life together, get your act together until you get to a place where you're comfortable enough to say, you know what, I'm not going to work today. Like, today I don't feel like doing anything. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I just want to lay in my bed. Yes, that's what I'm working towards. I want to I wanna sing this chord play and say, you know what, today I'm not, I'm not going to lift a finger. Because I've spent my time, my hours, my days, my months, my years educating myself to the point where I don't want to do anything. I just want to have someone to bring breakfast to me in bed. That's the goal. But if you think that, like someone said to me, that Sylvie, please focus on your own personal development, that's bullshit. If anyone says that to you, they're just jealous, okay? That's, they're very jealous. There's nobody on planet Earth who doesn't like good things. Nobody. Even the people who are on benefits abroad, when they get the money, the benefit money, they go and do their nails. Mm. They like good things. They wait, for the, they wait for the benefits money to go and break their hair. They're waiting for your uncle to give you money to go and break your hair. Why? Why don't you go out and break your hair yourself if you don't need money? Who doesn't need money? Who on planet Earth, this, this world, this capitalist world in which we live in, <laughs> I was watching a movie with my sister yesterday, like I said, very nice movie. I thought it was really nice because it had a very strong message that people have to work. People have to educate themselves. They have to work before they eat. And these two siblings, the three siblings, their father told them that they were very rich and all. Their father told them that, their father pulled a, 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 a quick one on them and sent them to go and work. I'm checking the time because I need to go and get my son from school and told them to go and work. And uh, the other one didn't go working. So his two siblings went and worked, came back and they were eating pasta and he wanted to eat and they said, no. So he went outside and started eating fruits from trees. And in the nighttime, he started throwing up and his brother came laughing at him saying, oh, you've gone and taken from nature. Now you're giving back to nature. Yes, there's no free lunch people. Educate yourselves instead of entertaining yourselves. Thank you, I'm out of here. I hope you enjoyed it. Please smash the like button. If you thought I made any sense whatsoever, comment in the comment section. What do you do at just with your spare time? And please, 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 please subscribe and click the notification bell so you get notified when I do upload the next video. My camera woman is standing right now behind the camera waiting to switch it off. Bye guys, take care.